So down at the bottom now, and uh, lock on clearly still in place. Protector removal team still here. Uh, I can't tell how many. How many still there, love? They're all out now. Are they all out yeah, now? Yeah. Okay. Are they okay? Were they treated all right? Any injuries? I don't know yet. Oh, he looks in pain. Mm -hmm. I'll stand on top of this police step. I've got a funny feeling they told me off. See, they always do that, don't they? Anything to block your view. Why? No, they blocked the view again. Constantly do that. It's just stupid. And yeah, the remnants of another fantastically built and very beautiful in its effectiveness lock on. Oh, thank you, Claire. That's very nice of you to say. It's one of the few comments I've been able to see. Um, okay, so I can't really get in to see. Oh, good, he's gone again. He looks like he might be a bit hurt. No Our way. Yeah. Isn't so she from Lancashire? So the whole of Lancashire. Doesn't she live in Lancashire? <laughs> oh, okay then. Oh, yeah, of course. I'm now thinking about the accent. You're entirely right. No, not quite. <laughs> oh, fuck off. I just didn't believe anything you say. I'm just, I'm, mate, I'm just waiting for my receipt from the illegal search from two hours ago. <laughs> we after been that, you know, well, I want it now, you know what I mean? I want to record it. What's practicable? Yeah, well, I will remind her for a minute. I'll be Me, I'm a 13. <laughs> I don't know why you're asking me, man. No, it looks like um, this one arrestee is going to Preston. I don't know who you are, sorry. I'm not bad. She's just blew Dance. you up massively. Shit. All right, Catherine. <laughs> and I'll just add I'm live streaming whilst you're doing that. Sorry, Tina. No, I'm saying that for you more than me. I'm trying to avoid names and just everyone's having a mm. Oh, If I can see the arrest. <laughs> this one is, yeah, this is my van.
This is the scene of the lock-on that started early this morning down at the bottom. Um, they were forced to act sooner than they wanted to um, by the police. Don't forget that if we had an option to protest in a non-violent way, as Articles 10 and 11 of the Human Rights allow us to, um, we would be doing it at the gates of the Quadrilla site where there is ample space for lock-ons, for slow walks, for banner protests, for any sort of protest we want. But unfortunately, the police have made that impossible for us um, by being used as the force that protects this private space for a private company. So they choose to not allow anyone um, near the site. I mean, originally in the early days, they never once had the police or security outside the fence in the entranceway on what is essentially a pavement. So in the end, we are driven um, away from there. So then we try to slow walk. So we come down here in an attempt to just slow walk vehicles, which would only, in essence, close off one vehicle, one lane, and it would just mean that vehicles are moving slowly in that one lane for a period of time, which is always better than closing off an entire road. But again, despite the fact that we are allowed to do this, uh, according to our rights, to protest, um, again, the uh, police will not make that possible. They just attack us every time we begin to gather to slow walk. They tried to tell us in the early days that the reason we couldn't slow walk was because this is a 50 mile per hour zone. It's now been reduced to an advisory 20. So, you know, that's a lousy excuse. Right, so let's check this planet B. We promised we'd look after this. And uh, it's looking a bit slippery. Yeah, so today, in summary, two successful lock-ons that have only just been... Uh, two sets of two pairs here that have been on since the early hours this morning, which unfortunately had to close, cause the road to close, which really wasn't useful because at the same time, over on uh, the M55, which is the alternate route, there was a vehicle fire, and that prevented the use of that road as well. But there was always room for an ambulance if it had chosen to go by. And then the second lock-on was at the top, just beyond the gates, between the gates and Wensleys. And then once that lock-on was cut off and the protester removal team made their move to come down here, another lock-on appeared in the nearly the same spot as the lock-on at the top. And then that was that. So in the end, the, the lock-on succeeded in stopping a day's work. Although we've had about two, three, four, about four vehicles, I think, as far as I know. I don't know how many other vehicles got in before I was up there. Uh, but other vehicles did go in. Um, but again, they look like these empty water tankers. And these empty water tankers are, we think, going in to collect the amount of, huge amount of liquid that's gathered on that site. We don't know what's causing it, aside from the torrential rain, but you can see it dries out. I mean, the ground here is dry. And yet, on that land, it is constantly wet. And we wonder if it's something to do with having hit the mains or something. And everyone's looking into it because we've got problems with our water and water pressure in the area. So we'll wait and see. Anyway, that's it for the day. So final lock-on cut off. Slow day for Quadrilla. Um, an upsetting day for drivers. Apologies from the protectors. What we save you from... Um, that causes you inconvenience now is to save you from something that will be far more damaging and long-lasting in the future. So that's all we can say, really. You know, if there was a facility for us to exercise our right to protest in a place that didn't inconvenience you, we would. And we know the M55 is a good route and we will always move for your ambulances. So in theory, what we do should not inconvenience you. But days like today where there's an overlap incident on the M55, well, that's just difficult, then, isn't it? So... Um, but there's nothing we can do to stop what we're doing. We need to stop this site from being developed. And that's that, really. So over and out for the day. Back to Maple, because it's dinner time.